In Archline XP, you can share complete categories instead of just single objects. And this has a very good advantage that actually uh, whenever you place a new item in that category, that will also be automatically shared with the others. So let me show you how that works. Now I'm working in a completely different project than my colleague, uh, but uh, we talked uh, over the phone and I discussed uh, with him that I would like to share uh, a few of the things that I've downloaded from the 3D warehouse for, from the BIM libraries and that I already organized into the bathroom library and it's called the uh, Bali in a series. That what, I, what I'm willing to do is to share the complete category. So I right click here and I click on share. Now the software publishes this uh, over the uh, server, which I already uh, defined in the options. So I'm going to show you where to do that. You go to the settings and you go to the uh, open and save. And actually here uh, in between the settings of the uh, creating network share, you will find an option that uh, where you would like to share complete categories. Uh, that is the location where you where you place this uh, this file that will be actually published. And once my colleague uh, is also set uh, setting up the same library, uh, and uh, I publish this uh, for. Um, objects inside that he will automatically see that so let's see what I've uh, published uh, there so I go to the bathroom here you can see the uh, Balina series and then these are the things that I published to my colleagues so let's see what happens on my colleagues computer okay so this is my colleagues computer uh, he's working on a bathroom project he asked for the sanitary wares and then uh, we will place uh, one of those here on his computer uh, so we will go to the objects library and we should find a library item, I mean a complete category on the bathroom called Balina series. This is what I have shared. Uh, so when we click here, uh, we can actually see the uh, little plus icon. That means this is shared over the network. So when I click here, uh, then I just select any of those items, like for example, this one. I click and drag over uh, the wall surface and then I can say I can save and place an object that was not originally downloaded from this uh, on this computer, but uh, on another computer. And uh, now over a network share, uh, it was published with the complete category. And then I could place it here and I can save the project with it. And from that point on, it will be part, part of this pro project. So even uh, when this uh, share uh, will be withdrawn, uh, as it was already placed, it's not a link, it's a copy of that object, so it will be stored. So you don't, I don't have to worry that I will lose it if, if uh, it's accident, accidentally erased from the shared library. Now let's see uh, how uh, this can be updated. So I will switch back to the co uh, previous computer and I will just uh, use, uh, I will just add a few more items and we will see what happens on this computer when I updated this uh, category on the other computer. Okay, so adding new items to an already shared category is pretty simple. All I need to do is just to find those items in my library. And I think uh, what I would like to share, uh, those things are all in the toilets library. And here I scroll down and I would like to add this and this. I'm actually just holding the uh, control key on my keyboard. So I'm just keep, uh, I will just keep adding uh, new items like that. And these things I would like to uh, recategorize. I would like to sort them into another category. And then now what I do, I just go to the, I just keep it in the bathroom category, but here I will select the one with the name of Balina series. And then I just hit okay. So now uh, those items will disappear uh, from this uh, library, except the one that I cannot be removed. And then uh, I will just uh, go back to the Balina series like here. Now two items are added here and then now I will go back uh, to the other computer to see uh, how it was, how it looks like after the update. So now here we go on the other computer and then let's check, uh, just check the objects library. And here we can find the bathroom and there now there are six items shared in the Balina series uh, with those two additional ones that I successfully shared over the network. Uh, so this is how easy, uh, easily you can share new things. You just uh, share one or two categories and then uh, you just simply 
uh, update the, the items, you can uh, move uh, things into those categories and then they will be automatically uh, published. Well, let me show you one another thing, how you can actually share multiple categories and how you can manage them. So for that, I will switch back to the original computer. So on this original computer, I will share uh, other categories and I will go into the project and for example, still uh, keeping in the bathroom category, I will share my cabinets uh, using the same share option. See, it's very simple. It's actually automatic and then now everything published uh, to the server and then whatever I put into this uh, library uh, will be automatically shared with my colleague. Uh, you can also see this tiny symbol here telling uh, that uh, everything in this category is shared and also I will share uh, things in the tabs library for example I click on share and then now everything will be shared automatically. So now this is how easily you can share uh, parts of your libraries, complete categories and then there is one last thing that I wanted to show you uh, and actually that is how to manage those libraries. Uh, except um, except uh, coming here and uh, just keep trying to find all the categories that you have uh, already published. You can find a centralized version, you can go to the options and then you can find the open and save tab here and you can just scroll down the same place where we actually managed uh, the share library itself. This is the uh, specified network location, uh, this is it. And actually, uh, but just below that, you can find a button with the word edit and you can go there and you can find all the libraries that you have shared. And if you would like to withdraw a share because it was actually accidental or you don't want to publish it uh, for any other reason uh, any longer, then you can just click on that and you can just click on remove and then it will be removed. So from this point on, whatever you put into this library, won't be shared and the, the, the whole category is not shared. Uh, the default frequency is, uh, as I remember, is 60 seconds. So uh, sooner or later, at least uh, over uh, 60 seconds, uh, any sort of change should be visible over the network. So this is how easily you can share any sort of complete category over the network.